All right, good morning, guys. We are going to get started. Now we do this. All right, let's get going. Let's have some fun today. All right. All right, guys, good morning. Uh, we're gonna have another fun one today. We are at the Morning Car Club uh, meet. This is another one of those exclusive ones that is themed. They are, if you haven't noticed, doing nothing but NSXs today. So this, this is gonna be crazy. This BBS is right-hand drive, like, that's how it's gonna go. They're trying to get everything set up. They're getting everything prepped first thing this morning. So you guys hang out, let me know what you think and uh, we're gonna have a fun one, all right? All right, guys, so I'm going to try and show you what's here. I'm going to try and talk about them a little bit, but they do always have music. So I'm going to try and uh, run through real quick, show you some of these in this section. Um, I might not be able to talk about them as much just because of music. But, uh, man, like if if you're an NSX fan, they, they definitely got you covered. So they've got everything from an extremely, extremely first-gen stock like you can see stock wheels stock ride height everything the color is really nice though somebody comment about which color this is because I, I actually don't know the color code off the top of my head so we got a little variety of everything we got one new gen just one which is kind of cool like you get to see the the similarities and or differences in between them um but we'll go down the row i'll show you some of the stuff oh. while they're still getting settled so you got First gen, new gen, 
and then the second gen all in all in yellow they look pretty cool though um, you guys don't know the the ones with the like exposed headlights or of course the second gen you know the NA2s uh, they do do a, a facelift so if you really know your car like you can tell in between the tail lights and a couple other body panels whether or not they've done the facelift in the front to update it um, I'm kind of on the fence because I, I like the like old school look of the pop-ups um, just the way it looks in the car but the 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 facelift with the second gen does look more up to date like it, it just does so got a little little bit of everything that's out today a bunch of advans some inkies this uh the white type r looking one is actually really nice um the only thing it's missing is a right hand drive but everything else on it is is perfect you've got te's on it white with red with the black accent recaros um some carbon goodies the the type r wing i like this one it's simple again you know my comment about hondas just the little simple upgrades is is all it needs this is interesting so it's like a it's like and i know it's not i it's like the apr like 3d wing um that's like the aftermarket wing does it have that's interesting i like the way that looks um so and they've got it fitted i mean i don't know how much you're gonna get out of it because of the the low deck height but it's pretty interesting i'd like to actually see some like some like wind tunnel on this to see if it's if it's really functional uh white on white on white with pro drives has the mugen seats um a little mix in the interior of uh like a white and black because it's got the black door cards um i i honestly probably would have went like super pimp and just like redone the seats with white and you know never been able to keep it clean but the the white on white with the white pro drives mm, looks good let's get the bridge seats black with the dark pro drives it's a good look nice row right there so we got Advan GTs, which I think are going to be my new favorite wheel. That's, I, I'm, I'm pretty much sold on those going on the, on the GTR. Um, as long as they clear the R35 brakes, that uh, it's a done deal. So, you know, big wing, I like that. <laughs> Handful of the works. This one, this one was cool. I got this one pulling in. If you guys, if you guys didn't see it, he integrated like a little third brake light, almost like a, I'll call it like an F1 style, right, right here. So I'm on both of the. It's hard to see, but it's right here. So it it lights up as he hits the brakes, and he's got it, he's got it flushed in and molded in. It it actually is really cool. So as he hits the brakes, those light up and then, you know, it's kind of like an F1 type style. Trying to get out of people's way. Everybody, everybody doing their thing. So we got a couple others lined up here and then the lot next to it, they, they do all the non-themed cars. So we'll go through those couple of s2ks there's r33 there's a couple good cars over there red one's got some stop techs on it it's old school three spokes 
They look like Advans, but I don't think they are. No, they're not. But they have that like old school Advan feel. You got the Red Bull themed one on the TEs. You know, it looks good. They do a really good job of lining everybody up and like filtering everybody in. So I'll show you the last couple this way and then we'll walk through the other section. Yeah, Sinister's NSX. I'll try and get you another little angle. And then uh, a fully wide-bodied like race prep one. Get out of the sun a little bit so you guys can see it. Got the vents on the hood. Looks good. It's got the, the wing with a uh, with a little gurney flap on it. You know how I feel about that because I had the gurney flap on mine and it made a huge difference. But I mean, you can see just how wide and kicked out this, this kit is on this one. So I'm gonna show you guys what's in the other lot and uh, you guys let me know what you think. Action, look at how cute you are. <laughs> you her nose right oh, you way. are so cute. <laughs> That's okay, I don't mind at all. We're gonna check out the little side lot. They've got some of the extra cars parked over here that weren't part of the the theme the NSX event for today. So you got a Porsche on some works wheels, Sparco seat. Got a little prep 350 over here. I call them all 8.6s, whether or not it's an 8.5 or an 8.6. This one, this one's an 8.5. I know the, the 8.6 purists will hate me when I see one and be like, oh yeah, there goes another 8.6 and it's actually an 8.5. But uh, I'm always down when they throw like retro wheels on an older car. They look so good. So we got a couple extra cars that came in. So the right-hand drive, man, I want to say chaser and I don't want to be wrong. <laughs> yeah, I was right. Okay, cool. The right-hand drive chaser. We've seen this at, at a handful of spots. I like the 90s forever sticker on it. That's cool. You got the yellow S2000, the white TEs. Can't go wrong with the white TEs. We always see our buddy at all the meets. You got the big boy here. Um, it was an R35, like, you know it's a monster. Um, as long as the tranny don't blow up on them, but. Got a couple S2Ks, park nose to nose. Advans versus the TEs. swan neck I'm all about I wish I had gotten that on mine but just didn't have time they were always super back ordered but for me that's sexy uh, we've got a nice little CRX at the JDM front end with the amber fogs that's the only way to do it on the old 90s cars you gotta run those amber fogs uh, you got an R33 you know, just an R33, just kidding. It's beautiful. It's just kind of parked up here like it's just another one of like the regular cars. Super stock inside. Um, from the outside, really, the only thing that sets it off is the wheels. That's it. I mean, everything else looks primarily stock on it. I'd like to see if he'd pop the hood for us, but we'll see. And then we've got a couple of the cars that parked outside. Got 3000 GT that's pulling in late.
I like how everybody's like freaking out on this thing. <laughs> All these NSX is here. You're good too. But uh, the little AutoZam decided to shut down the NSX meet. I'm gonna give everybody a second to shoot some photos, and then I'll show you guys the the little car that could. It's like a little mini NSX. At least that's what they're all saying. Let me show you guys real quick. Everybody's gonna get their photos, and then I'm gonna get out of everybody's way. Got the Nardi wheel. Look how tiny it is. All right, let me get out of everybody's way. That's so much fun. You guys, let me know what you think about that. M2? Really? I want to see it in person. All right, guys, so that was the morning car club, um, cars and coffee, NSX meet. It was crazy. There were so many good NSXs. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I tried to show you the extra cars that showed up, uh, the stuff down the alley that all park here. Um, but yeah, it was, that was incredible. I'm glad I got here early. I got the roll in for you guys. That was, ah, man, so many good cars today. You guys, let me know what you think. Drop a comment below. Let me know what NSX was your favorite. Hey, it might not even have been the NSX. It could have been the 33, the CRX. There were so many good ones today. Um, anyways, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to go on to my next one. I appreciate you guys hanging out to the end. And uh, as always, thank you. If you're, uh, if you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Uh, that notification, all that stuff so we can keep growing this channel. And... Uh, all right, guys, I'll see you at the next one. Thanks.